that sucker's shiny. Can't even, you can't imagine the glare. We're getting ready to go for another ride today. We don't know where. We may just join around town. We got some things to look at. And uh, anyway, we're going to go do another one today. I gotta, we're going to get ready. I've been working on the RV. Let me show you what I've been doing out here. Jeez, that thing blinds me. It's so shiny. But here's what we've been doing. You know I've been taking off the uh, striping because it's all cracking up. Well, that's what I'm working on today. Taking the rest of the cracked up uh, stuff right there. We've already taken it off the last slide. Uh, you say Montana, that's gone. So we still got a little bit of uh, striping to go that uh, is cracked up. But this here is all taken off now. I just got to fine tune it and there's a little glue here and there. We'll get that fine tuned, but we're going to go riding today. I'm going to keep the bike. Uh, I'll take it back tomorrow, I think. And uh, it sure made Vicky happy and she hasn't been happy in a long time. So that made her happy. It makes me happy. That's the only guy that doesn't make happy. <laughs> He's standing there guarding it. He don't want nobody to go anywhere without him, huh, Hank? Isn't that right? All right, that's what we're doing today. We're looking for something special this time, though. This is where we get our hot sauce. I don't know the name of this market, but it may be down. I'll show you what the market is. We parked a bike over there, and I'm uh, dressed in yellow so they don't run over me down here. But uh, here, here, I'll turn around. The Sunday market, I mean a Tuesday market at a church. So we'll see what we can find here. Hopefully Vicky can find her stuff. I don't see them anywhere. But I'll bet they're here. There they are, right in front of you, Vicky. Right in front of you. Yeah, that's where we get our hot sauce. And last time we got the extremely hot sauce. Right there. We're not going to get the extremely hot anymore. You Vicky can't. Vicky can't do it. <laughs> I'm filming you. Don't do that. Oh, because you gave me some soap and it was excellent. <laughs> I ruined somebody's skin. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what you thought you'd done because I tried some and it irritated me. And, oh, and it, 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 I remember this, yes. And yes. it irritated you that it irritated me. Yes, it did. So you gave me a regular bar with no nothing in it and it worked great. Awesome. No problem. And we, we like your uh, Volkswagen too. <laughs> that's what they said. We have one at home. They have a 66. Oh, I've seen him pass me. He's, I'm in a, I'm on a big diesel going down the road, and he just. <laughs> <"Burr!"> <laughs> Last year we made a film oh, of yeah. this guy right here. But you definitely. Hey, hey, yeah, and what are you selling here? I, this is a, a Tenzin EMS device. It, it's a combination of nerve I'm and. Trying to get you, you in and the sun out. Let's yeah. see if we. I think I got you. Okay. So yeah, this is a muscle stimulator used in physical therapy. It's great for back pain. It also incorporates uh, TENS technology, which is a nerve stimulator. And uh, we have some accessories like sandals, which are great for neuropathy or plantar fasciitis. We have the device, which is full-skill medical grade. And all units come with a two-year warranty. And, and, and like, I, like I told this young man that uh, we got one of these for Vicky yesterday, last year. She had her shoulder really hurting. And... Uh, a lot of people said, no, they don't work. You wasted your money. Well, maybe they didn't work on them, but they definitely worked on my wife. So uh, we uh, we appreciate that. Of course. My pleasure. <laughs> and we'll probably see you again. Maybe she'll come back and get some shoes. Definitely. Who knows? Anyway, my buddy Rick Seller is here. We're going to sell him something. Steve. Steve. Steve Seller. Steve. And his wife. What do you got to say, Steve? What do you want? These are awesome. Yes, they are. Yeah. They really are. They yeah. work really well. What do you want to say about the guys up in Idaho right now that are freezing? God, I hope they aren't turning blue, boys. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to go over the hill right now. Got my skid lid on just for that reason. Vicky's got her skid lid on. Wherever she is there. We're going to go and get on the freeway, so we're all dressed up and we're headed that way. It's pretty neat to see uh, Steve Sellers and some other... He's from Idaho, 
seen him in there. We got what product we need in there. And off we this go. is our adventure for the day, guys. We're over the hill and that's what we're on. Yep, we're on a motorcycle today. We're gonna check out this place right here. We don't know where we're going from here. Hey, we're retired, aren't we, honey? We can do yep. what we want. Yep. Well, you seen uh, where we were? Well, on the other side of that mountain is where we're camped. So this is what the other side of Telegraph Hill or Mountain, see that's why they call it, got all them things over there. This is, uh, this is off, not on the freeway. Freeway's over there. But uh, this is a cool little place. I haven't been here in quite a few years. Thought I'd bring Vicki over. She's never been here. So we're gonna check this out. And uh, she's taking a picture of me taking a picture. What can I say? What can I say? You said this is a cool little bar. Yeah, but you didn't want to come. I forced you. No, because I knew if you came here, you'd want to eat and drink. Oh, uh, well, anyway. Here's the little bar. Goes back in there somewhere. Maybe we'll get a picture of that. There's a bunch of food right there. Let's see what it looks like. We might be happy to drop your cowboy hat off here. Pretty cool little bar. We'll go take some video outside too. That's where most people go. You stop at these little bars, and there's always lots of little things to look at. Uh, we didn't film outside. We decided, after looking at the map, and talking to some locals, that we were going to go to Dome. Well, we didn't make it to Dome because we hit 95 before that and just took off down the highway. Well, another great day of riding motorcycles. Uh, we stopped we here. Uh, some of the at Fry's, it's a uh, grocery store. They sell liquor. We're going to get a bottle of booze for old Roy for his generosity on this motorcycle. Uh, I don't know how far we went today, but I know this ain't my bike. Woo! I don't miss my soft tail at all, like that dresser. Uh, but we had it's great to get in the wind, you guys all know that. And uh, we had a good day, we had a safe day, no problems. Went to uh, on that highway you just seen there, uh, Dome, up to Dome, but we didn't go to Dome because we hit uh, 95, uh, and we decided to come back and just go this way. Uh, it's great, great riding weather down here, but it is busy as you can see. Right now is peak snowbird uh, season, and everything is busy. There's traffic everywhere. This is. This town is not small. I think uh, they said there's around 200,000 people here during the snowbirding day uh, season. And uh, it drops about 50% during the uh, off season. So anyway, we had a great day today. We uh, really en enjoyed the bike. And, uh, that's all I got to say about that. I just wish Vicki would hurry up and get me out of the sun. I know you guys are freezing, but it's 80 degrees here today. Y'all have a great one. You know what to do. Subscribe and give me a thumbs up and all that good stuff. See you later, guys. Bye.